everybody. Um, today I'm going to bring you a mini haul and um, I'm so excited for this one because I actually went to the CCO today. Yes, we have a CCO where I live but um, I haven't been there in over a year so I really don't know what they have. I know that they have Mac at the CCO and Essay Lauder and I think I saw Bobby Brown items today as well. And I was really excited because I wanted to see what new MAC products that I could get from there. Um, I've been there before. I didn't really buy a whole lot of things previously. But um, I went in there to see what they have. However, I ended up buying less than I thought I would. Because before I left, I went to Walgreens. Um, but I, because I went to Walgreens, I ended up buying a few lip glosses. And it's because of Emily Noel 83. Thank you, Emily, if you're watching. Um, Emily is like one of my best favorite all-time gurus here on YouTube, and I really value her opinion. And I love watching her videos, and I, you know, find out and discover a lot of things from her. So I definitely bought this product today because of Emily. And um, I went to Walgreens, and normally I, you know, I've used Jordona products in the past. I've used their eyeliners. I think they're pretty, you know, pretty good. And they're so cheap. They're like $1.99 or 2 for $3, whatever. But I would have never ever tried this product had it not been for Emily. And it's their lip glosses. Um, I don't know if they just came out with these or if they've been sitting there and I just never um, thought to buy lip glosses from them because most of the time when you buy like, you know, a uh, cheaper price lip glosses they tend not to be very pigmented um, they tend you know to feel kind of cheap or whatever but these actually really impressed me as they did her but um, these are the Jodona lip gloss it says in color by Jodona and it says pretty shine luxury luxury gloss looks like this and they come in different colors I actually have on adorable which is number five and look at it it's so pretty I don't know how well you can see it on camera with the lighting but in the daytime I wore it in the daytime today and it gives off a very bronzy light bronzy uh, glowy um, gorgeous color I just love it uh, it makes me feel like I have a tan because when you put like a bronzy color on your face or even on your lips it gives you that glow and it gives you that tan look so this is what it made me feel like today and I actually went in there just to buy one um, to try it out and I actually loved it so much that I ended up coming back and buying a few more I have a darker brown and it's in babe I don't know if you can see that babe and then I also bought a light pink color which is sweet it's 06 sweet there's the color and then I got the really pretty bright pink and it's called Darling. These are really pretty colors, really pretty names. They are uh, very nice. This is um, the Darling Sweet Adorable and Babe. Very pretty color. And I'm actually wearing the adorable one, which is this third one right here. But they're very, very pretty colors. And you know, she mentioned that Normally with a lot of lip glosses you don't know they come on not as pigmented and you just kind of like say what's where's the color doesn't really show I'm actually not wearing any lipstick today so this is what you see is the lip gloss that's all I have on and I love them love them love them and I think they have a coral color I'm not really into corals so I didn't get that one and um, I think they had another pink color that was really close to this one so I didn't get it but other than that, I would have like bought all the colors because they're only like a dollar ninety nine. I mean, you know, you can't beat that. Okay, and then also I wanted to get the Wet n Wild eyeshadow pencils. Uh, they make really good primers. I have some of these, but I went ahead and got some more. This is the graphite color, and this one is. I'm sorry, I just got them, so I haven't really opened them up yet. Just so excited to share it with you. But I'm just I'm gonna open this one up. And it's just a really smooth consistency. They're very equivalent to the NYX eye jumbo pencils. And um, this one's a gray color, graphite. And they make a really good base before you put on your eyeshadow. And also I got the cream color. And it's called cream. Uh, wait. Uh, no, <laughs> that's not the color. The color is called Pixie. 
and that's the the light um, golden color I have here and this one doesn't open as easily and then I got the blue looks so pretty so I haven't opened this one either but that makes a really pretty base and these are like a dollar ninety nine that's a good sub dupe uh, substitute for NYX jumbo eye pencils if you don't want to purchase those and another love of mine is um, I really really love trying all kinds of lip balm I probably tried so many I know I've tried every single drugstore lip balm along with some others but the one lip balm I haven't tried that is drugstore is Nivea and I have to rave about this um, you know I went into the store CVS one day had a these are $2.99, so they're kind of expensive for drugstore lip balms, but I mean, there's so much. This one I got, they only had one color at the time that I bought it, and this one says it's a kiss of shimmer. It comes in like a pink tube, like this, and when you actually, um, the color is very, it does give a little bit of a, a tint, a light color tint. It gives a little shimmer to your lips. This one got a second one this one actually has a kiss of flavor this one really doesn't have much of a flavor but this one actually has a kiss of flavor and this one is um, the berry I believe it says passion fruit but look at this color it comes on like with a lot of tint so definitely when it goes on your lips you have more of a tinted color that's it right there uh, you can't really see it. You, your lips definitely have more of a tinted color than the, the pink one. But definitely this gives you color and this one gives you more of a shimmer. They're both kind of shimmery on your lips. But if you really don't want much color, this is a better choice. If you want that definitely taste of passion fruit on your lips and a little bit of color, then this is a better choice. But I love both of them. And then, um, so I showed you all that. So let's move on to the MAC items. I got two MAC items. Um, at the CCO and this is one of my god it's the mineralized skin finish I already have a mineralized skin finish but I'm hitting pan on that so I got this one this one is the uh, medium natural it has if you've never seen one of these this is what it looks like um, this one is the medium color down here and then you have the tra um, the shimmer which is the upper part of this and I know my lighting is terrible Oh, and I fell in love totally with this color. This is the mineralized skin finish as well, but this is more of a um, of a blush for me. And it looks like this. It's gorgeous. It has that like reminds me of um, that raspberry color. It's really pretty. I know you can't see much of it on here, but it's so pretty because it has that raspberry with a tint of gold in it. Um, this one is actually called, uh, I'm sorry, this one's 19. This one's called Petticoat. And oh, I also went to Sephora a few days back. I got this Benefit right here. It's, um, it's really neat. Um, this Benefit package, which is worth $105, it's called the Legally Bronze. And it's $105 value, but it's only $35. And real quickly, what it has in here is you get the um, the Benefit uh, color. This is the matte bronzer that they have. It's called Hula. It's a just a light a brown color. And then um, you get the Bad Gal Brown Mascara, which is just their brown mascara. And then you get the... Um, the this is the gold highlighter that you can use on your you know eyes or whatever but it's gold it's a gold color and then the real reason I really wanted to try this was their um, their highlighter it's called high beam and I want to be able to use it on the top of my cheeks right here for a glow and this is what that looks like I have here's what it looks like and you know you just use a little bit of it and put it on your cheeks but all this is worth $105 and you get it in this package for $35 at Sephora um, you know I think it's just a limited quality quantity so as soon as they run out they probably won't have any more so if they still have them at Sephora you may want to check this out um, that is it that is my mini haul and um, 
I hope you have a CCO near you so you can go check out some MAC products. And then also uh, the Jodona lip glosses are my new, new love. So I definitely love that.